Hello, this is Andy Ford with Andy Ford Video, and today we're going to look at one of the Plotiverse apps called Plotograph Pro. We're in the app, and I've uploaded a photo of a waterfall in Iceland. And what we want to do is add some movement to the still image. So if we go on the left-hand side and click on the animation points icon, which looks like this dancer, we see we have the ability to add animation points. So here you see I've added an animation point, but when I hit the play button, you won't see any motion. This is because I need to add a direction. So now look and I draw an arrow, notating the direction that I'd like the motion to happen. You can also do this upon making a point. But as you can see when we hit the play button, we're getting something very strange. The entire image is basically drifting downward. And that's because we didn't set any stabilization points. In the same menu, you see that we can add stabilizer points. So for example, if we add stabilizer points around this downward area of the waterfall, we will create a boundary for the motion. Now we hit the play button, we're getting a realistic motion. So if you take a minute or two and think about the motion that your image needs, you can set up a bunch of animation points and stabilization points like I've done here. Now when I hit the play button, you'll see the motion. In the animation properties, you can also control the speed of the animation. You have different modes. You also have the ability to add a zoom that you can control the speed of. But take a look in this area here. It's not perfect, so what I can do is delete a point and then re-add it and also reinforce it more stabilization points if necessary. And now when we look at this, everything looks great. So it's relatively quick and easy to add motion to a photograph with Photograph Pro. Thank you.